I, wasn't, I never really thought about selling cars or anything. It was kind of just on a whim. Um, I had a couple buddies that worked at a dealership. I actually was supposed to be at another dealership and put it in my GPS and, and wound up here. And so I came in and asked for a job. Went to my interview at the other dealership. I just felt more welcome here. I felt more at home, felt more comfortable. Been doing it for, you know, going on four years now. I, I really enjoy helping people, seeing people get excited about, you know, getting a new car and trading in, you know, maybe their old used car that's not running so well and getting into something that's reliable. Seeing the excitement and joy in people when they, you know, take delivery of their new car and it's really what it's all about. Making people happy and making them feel welcome and comfortable with the whole process. That's what I enjoy most about selling cars. I really think that the experience that people get here is far better than the experience they would get at other dealerships. You know, I've seen it firsthand or I've had people come in and tell me that the experience that they had here was, you know, a lot better. We treat people with respect, um, we're honest, transparent with numbers and things like that. The, car, the quality of the cars that we put on our lot is, I, I believe it's better than a lot of other dealerships in the area. We take pride in the stuff we put on our lot. I would feel comfortable sticking one of my family members in any one of these used cars that we have out here because of that. We're in a weird market right now, but even now, you know, we're not charging over uh, MSRP. We don't have any market adjustments. We're not making people take warranties if they don't want to. The only thing that we add is the wheel locks on the car, which I think, you know, everyone should have on their vehicle. From what I've had people come in and tell me is that, you know, I make want to make them feel welcome. I'm pretty laid back with my approach. I'm not very pushy when it comes to the sale. I let people take their time. If they need to think about it, I'll follow up with you, and then they can come back in. But I think that's what most people like about my approach in sales is it's not a very uh, harsh approach. It's very laid back, taking the time that they need, you know, not not rushing them through certain things if they have questions, you know, taking the time to answer the questions thoroughly. Try to be in as efficient as possible and as, uh, obviously with the experience, I know where to kind of spend more time on one thing versus another where, you know, they're gonna enjoy that better, make it a better experience for them. I think people can really see that when they come in. They can tell, you know, that I have the experience and knowledge and that also makes them feel more comfortable coming back. I think it's helped us grow because it's really shown us as a dealership, it's shown our true colors. There's a lot of places out there that are taking advantage of customers at the moment, you know, forcing them to pay over um, MSRP, making people take warranties or maybe products that they don't necessarily want. So as a business, I think it's really helped us show our true colors in the fact that we're not trying to take advantage of people. You know, we're in this for the long run. You know, people can see that we're really here to help people and not take advantage of them. My advice to them is one, before you come into the dealership, I would, I would suggest do a little bit of research on what you want because when you're coming into the dealership, it can be overwhelming. There's a lot of cars on the lot, a lot of different features and things like that. I'm always, I'm always happy to help people you know, do research or you know, send them articles and stuff like that. Um, there's a lot of good third party uh, sources out there that have a lot of good information on not only Honda but you know other other competitors of our of our dealership and there's a lot a lot of good info that I can point people to. It can make the process a lot easier. I think one of the best qualities uh, for a salesperson to have is to be honest. If you're, if you're honest and trustworthy, that can go a long way. As soon as you lose someone's trust, every uh, anything you say to them or do, they don't necessarily take everything that you say seriously because they think that you might be you know, dodging them or playing games. So I, I think just being upfront and honest with people, being as transparent as possible, really goes a long way. And I think that's one of the best qualities to have as a salesperson. We 
we all done? Yeah. Good. Cool. So I'm not going to play that long form. It's going to be me. I'm going to cut it into a. Yeah. Chop it up.